Is vaping less dangerous than smoking? The research may not be so clear cut. Take a recent study, which tested both e-cigarette vapor and cigarette smoke on lung cells, and found e-cigarettes to be much less harmful. In fact, e-cigarettes only damaged the cells when vapor levels were unrealistically high. The study argues that a normal amount of e-cigarette use isn't toxic. Even though the study was peer-reviewed, some are saying people should take the findings with a grain of salt, given who funded the research, a tobacco company that's recently started selling e-cigarettes. For tobacco brands, it makes sense to get into the e-cigarette industry. Current cigarette smokers and those who've recently quit have been more likely to try e-cigarettes. The product's been promoted as a way to help cigarette smokers kick their habit, but much of the research on e-cigarette safety has been paid for by members of the industry. While e-cigarettes may reduce some health risks compared to regular cigarettes, such as lung damage, vaping may actually introduce new health problems. Now is a crucial time for public opinion, though. Americans have been pretty split 50-50 on whether e-cigarettes are safer or more dangerous than regular cigarettes. For Newsy, I'm Ryan Beek.